Welcome back to my After Effects tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to create this. Let's start with creating a new composition. Make it 10 seconds. Now import all the project files. Link is in the description. Let's create a new text layer. Now auto trace the text layer and delete the old text. Then hide this. Then create a new solid layer and apply element from video copilot. In the custom layer, change the layer to your text layer. Now go to scene setup and click on extrude. Set path tessellation to ultra. Here I applied some stone material from pro shader to pack. And increase the thickness little bit and enable back bevel. Now for the diffuse, change the texture map. Set brightness, contrast and saturation. I am using this environment. Then click on OK. Then create a new parallel light. Now turn on the multi object. Add keyframe on Y rotation. Z position. And X scatter. Press U to see keyframes. Rotate the Y position. Go to around uh, 4 seconds, then make all the values to 0. Now adjust the Z position. Now add a keyframe on X displays and animate it over time. Create a new camera, then add keyframe on position and point of interest and animate it also over time. Then add keyframe on Z scatter and scatter it over time. And also adjust the Z position according to your text. Now make all the keyframes easy ease. Now enable shadow ambient occlusion and motion blur. Now apply unsharp mask and curves to add some color correction. I am using this rocky edge to create the broken effect on the text. Now duplicate the element 
and place it over top of Rocky Edge and change track mat to alpha mat. Now apply Curves and make it a shape to increase the contrast. Now increase the reds and decrease some blue to add a burning look effect. Then add glow over it. Now duplicate the layer and flip vertically and position it little bit down. Add some rotation on it and adjust the position as shown. Now crop the rocky edge layers, apply linear wipe and reveal the rocky edge from left to right. Create a new solid layer. Apply saber effect, set it to electric. And change the blend mode to transparent. Now adjust the core end and start as shown. Add keyframes and animate it as some electric wave strike over the text. Then adjust the keyframes of the rocky edge and strike to sync them properly. Now create a new solid layer for the background and add gradient ramp and set color to dark brown. Set ramp scatter to 100% and animate the opacity over time. Now add some spark and fire particle effects. Add curves and add some glow over it. Select all the layers and pre-composite. Press P and add keyframes frame by frame by changing the position to add a wiggle effect. Now press 0 to ramp preview. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Make sure to subscribe to my channel for more amazing tutorials.